today we're looking at, uh, we have some cans over here, and the cans, you can see that they have a inch and a half firecracker between the two cans going on. The moment I'm going to shoot them, we got a single can by itself, even more deep pursuit. Got the restless knights on the other side, but it's clearly twice the mass of the other one. That's four meters this one. This landed about um, two meters over this direction. So the double the mass can went about um, half the distance of the single mass can. Can we see the board okay? No, I can. Okay, so this is the law of conservation momentum. When setting up the law of conservation momentum, these are our two masses. We've got the mass on one side of the can by itself and we've got the mass of the two cans and whatever momentum we start with we should also end with on the other side because we don't have any external forces except for gravity pulling them downward we don't have external forces so whatever momentum you start with you have to end with but you're going to notice the starting momentum was actually zero for both cans at the beginning that means they can't have any momentum after the fact you might say how do you have no momentum after the fact well, one can is going the opposite direction of the other. So zero plus zero is zero. So this plus this also has to sum to zero. So if I subtract the M2 and the V2, by the way, the prime, that means afterwards. No prime on these Vs means that's the initial velocity. A prime means that, that's, the, um, initial, that's the velocity after the kaboom. So that means this has to be the same amount of that, but opposite direction. So if I put that on the other side, we have the same momentum of the two cans as what we do have the single cans. Clearly, we have twice the mass of the double can, but that means to have the same momentum but opposite direction, you have to have a negative opposite direction, that's half the velocity. So that's why the single can went twice as far as the other can because it's going twice as fast. It's got half the mass, that means it's going twice as fast. Or if this is twice the mass, that is half the velocity. You have the same momentum beforewards and afterwards. End. Oh, my God. Okay. It's so